What's up guys? So I got a nice little video for you, a little update video. It is a Friday and we actually got an update out on a Friday. Early technically if we were like releasing every week still. Like I said in my last video, there's no real schedule at the moment. We're just kind of trying to release content as as much and as quickly as possible just so, you know, you know just so you guys have stuff to do. So uh, with the update, uh, just a couple fixes. Uh, Juggernaut was uh, improved. I believe I in a couple updates ago I said that the Juggernaut was improved, and I don't think it was, or at least not as much as it is now. And it's been improved again, and also now has a special attack very similar to the Dragon Longsword special attack. Uh, does more damage than the Dragon Longsword would do, but um, not really meant to be like anything. It's just kind of a, a thing, right? It's not really huge. I don't expect anybody to like PK with it or to do massive amounts of damage or anything like that, but. You know, it's a thing, right? And it's better. It's a it's a thing you already owned that's that's now better. Or if you didn't own it now, you have slightly more motivation to get it. So for this weekend only, the question mark boss over here is going to drop three times as many pumpkins. Now this is just the base amount, so it drops uh, at minimum three and at maximum nine. So uh, yeah, definitely try to do the the boss this weekend. Get some extra pumpkins in. Uh, character customization is currently disabled. This should allow new uh, new accounts to be made. Uh, obviously, that's something we're going to fix. <laughs> we want you to be able to uh, change your character, but you know now at least new accounts can be made, and obviously we we need that. Uh, all the object issues that we talked about in the last update video are now fixed. There might still be some issues. It's possible if if there if you find any, please just report them, and we'll you know work on them. But the donator zone one, this one was was a good example of one of them that needed fixed. If you have a book of terror or a book of light, you can now use a knife on them to get some extra energy. I believe it's 75 energy per, so uh, it's a re real good source of energy if you have any extras. The main reason is extras. And then you can now disassemble Sliske Spear for uber components, 50k minimum, 100k maximum. So it is a really nice chunk of components. So uh, not a whole lot in this update, but, uh, you know, hopefully everything is nice and, you know, fixes improvements, making everything better. And, uh, you know, I guess if we can try to do that every week, then, you know, the server will slowly get better and better. Right? Uh, in terms of what we want to do, you know, in the future, it's, it's God Wars 2. God Wars 2 and Theater of Blood are the next big things. You'll probably see some little stuff splashed in, but yeah, as far as content goes, the next biggest, the big things you'll see will be those two. So, and you should be able to expect to, expect to see them anytime soon. November was my uh, was my time frame for God Wars Two. I'm working on God Wars Two, and, and Dark is working on Theater Blood. So I, I don't really know much about when you'll see Theater Blood. I know he's he's he, you know he messages me every now and again that a boss is done or complete or uh, giving me an update on it, but as far as the time frame, I have no clue. Um, as far as the time frame, God Wars 2, I'm expecting it to be the end of this month, but we will see, we will see, we do have a lot of time, we do have, you know, what, 26 days or so, so we'll see what happens.